love me hey. I love me enough for the both of us Yeah, yeah. That's why you should <coughs> hi guys welcome back to my channel so um for today's video i'm doing a little like mommy type of video so um yeah i hope you guys are interested i'm doing a what's in my diaper bag video because um yeah i just carry a lot of shit like in general for myself so for my baby you already know i have to carry like twice as much as stuff so as much as stuff that's not funny but anyways um so yeah, i've been wanting to film this video for a very long time and now we're finally here so yeah so this is my pretty much my new current diaper bag it, it is just a backpack now and i just put this little thing on it but yeah it is a backpack now i started off at first I started off with a purse well a diaper bag literally a diaper bag um i got this diaper bag at burlington I think it was like 60 bucks it was cute or whatever while it lasted because yeah you see that it's like black i don't know if you guys can see bubble that's all bubble right there this side it's like a little beat up but it's not that bad but i mean it was getting there so i had to switch it up because literally you know um since boa helps me out he was since boa helps me out you know he carries the portarebe and then he usually carries the diaper bag most of the time you know when we get off anywhere so then that meant that you know he just doesn't give a fuck and he's just wherever the fuck he touches touches walls and all that and you know that's pretty dirty so se me empezó como a ensuciar poquito on the sides and i was already like man i'm gonna have to get another diaper bag because you know i don't want to be you know carrying nothing beat up like i don't so i was upset because this one was really cute if you're I don't know if you're into purses and this is the one because this is literally like it goes um as a purse type of thing like you can pretend it's a purse like it looks really cute which I loved but um because literally if you don't want to carry a purse you just put your wallet in here with your baby's stuff and you're good to go and it's li literally like a purse but um since I still carried my own purse and Bubba helped me out it really just yeah he kind of he kind of just beat it up so then i was like okay i need to get a different one but if you're interested in a cute bag like this this is juicy couture and i got it at burlington so it was very cute i still recommend it because it's very spacious it even came with a diaper mat i don't know if it's called a diaper mat the changing mat for you to change your baby which i'm still using in my new diaper backpack but um yeah I, i'm still gonna use that one when whenever i need extra like i don't know whenever I don't know I'll, I'll end up using it eventually whether it's like just to carry Chanel stuff like extra stuff I don't know I really don't know but um, another backup little backpack that I had gotten which we used for a bit was this which is the cutest little backpack um, but you see the space is kind of like okay it fit exactly what you need for like the moment for like for like half a day or even a full day but um, barely to the point where we kind of already beat it up a little bit so that's why I got the big bag but it's very cute and convenient i do recommend you guys no matter what you get whether you get a diaper bag or if you get a little backpack i mean a, a big backpack as a diaper bag to still like purchase like a little small backpack for like moments when you're just like trying to get off the car and you're like i don't want to carry the big old diaper bag or i'm just going to the store like i'm not going like i'm going to come right back and you don't want to carry so much then you know you pull out the little cute little backpack you put it on your back and you go to go sis i do recommend it because this one was actually what made me want to get the big backpack because I realized that this was easier for Boba to carry because he literally put it on his back and then he'll carry the portabebe and it was like a piece of cake. He wasn't over here beating it up like he beat up the other one so I was like I need to just change to a backpack so it is. So I do feel like backpacks are convenient because if you're still like girly and want to carry your own personal purse well bitch you just put it on your back and you got your own bag on the side you know what I mean and also because it makes it easier for your man to carry like it works fine but you know your man most likely might beat it up because he's gonna you know they don't know how to fucking carry a bag or a purse so they just fucking run it slide it through the wall wherever the fuck they're walking and it's just yeah so i think a backpack is you know especially if you're trying to get the help from your man or even for yourself it's very convenient i really like this one so the first one i got this one i got it at burlington this one was at ross 
and then this one was at Dee Dee's bitch I like it because it looks very cute and trendy and yeah so first off where should I start with um should I start with the inside or the outside well maybe the outside the outside is easier so the first thing I have bitch is a fan wrong way a fan because bitch I'm extra but also my baby finna be extra and also because it's hot as fuck in Texas no matter what you already know this I feel like these are a must have I use this for my makeup I use this for personal use I only have one of these and obviously like where I do my makeup I have like two or three I don't even know how many I have one in the car just for backup I have one in my purse and I and um I even have one in my baby's diaper bag which matches this pink because you know no matter what I don't know if I'm you know may have mine or may not have um mine on that day i don't know just in case i want to make sure that i have a fan because it'd be hot and my baby's not going to be out here you know struggling like i'm i'm going to blow some air no matter what uber like no matter where we are like usually you know when we're in parties outside like it's fucking hot so i literally pull this out and i start fanning my baby and you know i don't know it really comes in handy and it doesn't take up that much space so that's why i have one in my purse and i make sure that she keep i keep hers in her diaper bag because it's a must have the next thing are her little shades my baby my baby has like two other pairs but um i choose to keep this one in her bag because it's like the lightest shade of pink and i feel like it'll go with everything so if you know if you have a I do feel like these are must-haves even though you might think like bitch what that's just for them to be cute but they are because honestly you know cuando like quieres que les tape poquito el sol like literally my baby is such a good baby i put them on and she does not take them off like she doesn't unless until they fall off by the, on their own but she does not take them off and i feel like you know they're very like helpful like i said when you're out in the sun like this will come in handy so i feel like you should always keep a pair whether you have a little boy or a little girl keep a pair in their little baggie you can get you know these anywhere so that's that in this it comes with like a little separate baggie and i like it because you see it's very thin but bitch this is where i keep like something extra for your baby you always 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 need to keep like a little extra little onesie right now since it's hot i honestly just keep um one in there and like no le tengo que poner trajecito but it, if when it was cold i made sure i kept like um, well, especially if it's a newborn, you need to have more than one outfit, I feel, because newborns, you know, they might throw. Because I feel like more accidents happen usually when they're newborns, you know, I don't know. I, that's just me, like, what I think, especially because you're a new parent. And, yeah, I just feel like more accidents happen. So, when, if you have a newborn, I would pack up more than one outfit. Like, I would pack up maybe, like, two onesies. And if it's cold, I would still pack up a little sweater and some, like, little tights or pants, whatever, you know, boy or girl. And, you know, some socks, for sure, some socks, like, at least a pair or two of socks. Because, anyways, the socks are very tiny. They don't take up space. But since it's hot right now, there's no need for me to pack, pack you up, you know, warm. So, I honestly just keep one onesie. But, like I said, if it was cold, I would be packing up some tights for her. And I would be packing up some socks. And, um yeah but since it's not honestly she doesn't even need shorts so i'm not even gonna carry that extra or whatever i just carry an extra bib right now you know she's not eating food or anything so she doesn't really need like bibs that bad but just to carry a cute one if for some reason like i just want to put a bib on when i'm feeding her and i just make sure that it's a little cute one you know you want to keep your little ratchet ones at home i did add on to my bag i have a a beanie which is her size just because it is hot as fuck but you know when you're in texas that a pente viene el aire and long story short you know like no quieres que se refresque tu baby so i just feel like a beanie is convenient because it doesn't take up space like you guys see and um it's just in case if de repente it's like you know raining or it's nighttime now and it's fucking you know it's necessary well my baby gonna be covered now the next thing i have inside is obviously her bottles which low-key right now you know tan sucias but i usually carry three bottles for her um yeah and they fit in this backpack so i carry three bottles but like i said they're dirty right now so i'm not going to show them but um because she just woke up and ate and etc but um i carry three bottles for her i use this little divider container whatever they sell them everywhere honestly i'm pretty sure you guys know about these um and this comes in handy i feel like when you have a newborn i personally didn't like to use it just because you're feeding them so often so it's so many more bottles to feed them that i felt like this wasn't really doing you no type of like it's the same shit i used i was actually carrying the whole container the whole similar container um because yeah it was just like i have to feed my baby like i don't even know how many bottles she was drinking you know every two hours so that's a lot of bottles and 
and when you're gonna be out and about the whole day like imagine you know what i mean how many bottles and it's just like three ain't gonna ain't gonna cut it you know what i mean so it was like what's the point of like i just i just didn't see the point but now that my baby's five months it, it is convenient because she's drinking less bottles so obviously um i keep a semi like at my mom's because usually no matter what we always swing by you know to check up on my mom and etc so i'm usually covered like i we usually don't leave you know early so but if if i if for some reason i knew like we're going somewhere since like the morning and we're going to be out the whole day and we're not stopping by at, at my mom's then yes i'm probably going to carry the big container in the car and then just keep this one filled up and when it empties out you know fill it up but most of the time you know at my mom's we have water for the baby and we have um a whole container of stimulex so i'm always covered up like if we swing by over there and i use some of this i just fill it up and then you know if you have a newborn i don't necessarily recommend this um you could use it but at the same time you just know you're gonna have to be still carrying your big container maybe in the car and like have to keep filling it up because especially if you're gonna be gone for hours because yeah this ain't gonna cut it but if you already have you know a five month old and etc then you know this comes in handy so that yeah that's what i carry now the next thing is this which is honestly like one of my favorite things I don't know it doesn't have a specific name but it's not a birth like a birth i meant a burp uh cloth but it's not like a cover it's not i don't know i just feel like these are definitely a must-have like bitch look how long it is watch you see this and it's very thin like it's super thin like super thin guys so it's not hot and it's perfect because you know right now it's hot so like literally this is what i carry for her as a cover but also um also to feed her because um yeah like i just put it around her like this and the bottle holds on right there um also for when they have accidents and they throw up but you got a whole little like top of towel clean it up you're good to go um i don't know it's just very convenient i honestly use it for everything so i have a lot of these and this is my this is definitely one of my most recommended things that i recommend to you guys because like look i just fold it up it takes up no type of space it's fresh etc i even keep one of these under her little um porta bebe like so it could give her some cushions so i use a lot of them for so many things that i don't know this is a must have i'm telling you right now i also have these which are also like little supposedly to wash to sh shower them but but obviously i use them for you know feeding her to clean to clean her little mouth i also put it around her neck and it works just fine i really like these because they're so tiny that literally like let's say she already has a bottle made and you're getting off to a store and you're like i'm not trying to carry all that shit just carry one of these or two of these or like i said your little savanita and you're fucking good to go so i really like this because you could always carry one of these in your purse and no te estorba para nada so these are obviously another thing is her chupon which is definitely a must have um because it helps her go to sleep and relax so she loves her chupon she definitely has backup chupones so now this is just an extra one but yes chupon is always a must have i always carry at least four to five diapers but like i said if you know you're going to be out for a while you know i would carry enough diapers for like the whole day which would be like you know six seven eight just in case yeah at least four to five you know if you're just gonna be out for like the night i would carry because sometimes you never know like you just change her pee diaper and then it turns into a, a poopy diaper like you know back to back and then boom you have to put on those so i always like to make sure like i never want to be in a situation where my baby's stuck being pooped forever or where i don't have shit i don't i don't want to be in that type of situation another thing that i have is this little baggie you see it's thin también you open it up I pretty much just have toys if you guys can tell I have her little teething um, toys which is like necessary you know once your baby starts teething you should definitely buy her little toys like this her little sonaha her little keys and she has more toys I even have her little book right here she has more toys but um obviously I don't want to carry all of them but I do want to make sure that I have toys for her because I don't want my baby to be bored like I don't I don't care like I don't care on the always start she wants to start in a park or wherever we are at I don't want my baby to ever be bored so she always needs to have toys just in case and plus because you never know when they're gonna act fuzzy you just don't know but another thing I carry it is the which just takes up a little bit of space but I mean it's worth it it is the changing mat which came in with the um the first diaper bag that I showed you guys um so I might see like it has a little stretchy thing you open it up you open it up and it's actually pretty big 
you see that because my baby's five months and she's really long and it still worked out for her and like i literally just used it yesterday so i'm telling you guys like this is worth it so if it doesn't come with your diaper bag i recommend you guys like whether you search on amazon or you know go to like walmart target burlington ross dds whatever and get you a mat because you never know like where you're gonna be at and you know you're gonna need to change your baby and one if people get mad like don't change your poopy diaper in the couch you know be like bitch i got a mat and you know no te vas a hacer nada or two also because of the germs like if you're gonna be at walmart and you just really have to change your diaper like you know you there's there's a lot of germs and etc but also because if you're also in your car and you're like fuck i have to change your diaper but you kind of don't want to cause a mess in your car or dirty it up or dirty someone else's car like but you just pull out the mat and you're good to go but you could also do that with the little blanket the little sabana but this is just perfect and another thing i have is this little container which i bought at Didi's. it came with another packet like a gray one and honestly it, it's perfect it's the perfect size for what you need for a day like you're gonna have to be restocking but honestly like baby girl doesn't you know use up all of these just like in one day or whatever you know so this is still good enough but of course i would still keep an extra pack of you know white piece in the car i feel because it's just necessary when you have a kid but that's it but this is perfect for one it looks cute and you know for two you know you're not wasting that much like space or, or whatever and it does the job another thing i have we're almost done guys just two more baggies this one and another one this is just a bag and it really was a makeup bag if you read it it says i have way more makeup at home by Too faced it came with some palettes that i bought but you know i thought it was really cute so i was like this is gonna be for my baby girl you know to carry her diaper bag in here i just keep like essentials well necessities because you know what germix is a necessity hand sanitizer i mean it's not even germix hand sanitizer um because yeah you never know when your hands are going to be dirty or someone else's hands and you know i'm talking about dirty dirty or that repente you know bola comes home from work and you know he's all dusty and etc like put some germix on or hand sanitizer so this is a must-have for sure for sure no matter how old your baby is you always need to carry hand sanitizer in case their hands are dirty yours or another thing is oops, I'm over there. Okay. another thing is okay my since my baby is teething now i bought the orajel or orajel i don't know what it's called but you know in spanish mexican style you know we say orajel so it's literally baby orajel or whatever you want to call it but um they have this one is the nighttime and then it comes with a daytime i bought it at the give cvs so yeah it came with two and yeah since my baby's teething it helps you know so yeah it just helps a lot so i'm just the type that no matter what i'm gonna carry everything just because i don't know where i can be and my baby could be acting fuzzy and baby that's not gonna be a situation okay so yeah so literally this is something i have to carry the little you know booger sucker whatever you want to call it um because literally you never know when your baby have a booger and you want to have this in hand it's just that simple this was for when she was um um she had gotten sick like the nia como like la tos and just i'll talk about these later on my baby must has videos so i'm not even getting to, you know just things in case that she acts fuzzy i want to make sure that i have the remedy so this is pretty much just remedies you know the heringa um i keep pretty much just that in this bag um just because like i said i never know if you know just in case i just want to have this bag ready for like if i have to go somewhere bitch i could go and if i need to last all day bitch we're straight we're safe baby girl is good now this is the last thing i have in my diaper bag which i do recommend this this is going to be my baby must have video if you can buy this for sure for sure at target i know i've seen it for sure there like for sure for sure at target i don't know about walmart and etc but i'm pretty sure this is it's by johnson's or whatever johnson's whatever i didn't like brand and it literally comes with this little pack which if you're a person that you're like i don't got time to be you know packing up shit this is the one to get because it literally comes with these and these are lifesavers which you could tell i need to buy another pack this is my second pack but it comes with it's um johnson johnson's hand and face wipes, which i'll get more into the benefits of that in you know my baby must has video which should be coming up pretty soon but yeah it comes you know with the full little pack but it's literally gone now but i feel like it's always a necessity because you never know when your baby's gonna be dirty another thing that um that came in that little pack by itself is the baby lotion which is a must-have because oh 
okay it's a must have because yeah you you always want your baby to you know be smelling good so when people carry her or him you know is the head to toe wash and shampoo which i think i kind of opened oh my god but yeah it comes with this which is good like i don't know and then it also came with desitin or i don't know how you say it desitin or desitin i don't know in english but you know pretty much you know for rashes for your baby rashes which is good that's what it comes with which is a good enough like little travel size um pack that's pretty much what you need to carry but i added some stuff to it because you know i am just uh just in case have a bitch like i said in my um get to know me video so i added some um kleenex or tissue whatever tissue paper you want whatever you want to call it just because you might need a napkin bitch yeah. you never know you might need a fucking napkin so you know you're gonna be sick i added a corta uñas because i know i could keep this at home but honestly like i'd be forgetting to cut her nails and sometimes when you're you know out and about that's when you remember like oh shit i need to cut her nails so why not just did i just break it with the foot i added another jeringa which is supposed to be like this i believe i oh no wait that's the one i don't know i have three what the fuck i didn't know that anyways and then a little thermometer or whatever because just in case like i said you're somewhere out and about and you're like i think my baby has a fever bitch you got it i just feel like you have to have it because you never know when your baby's gonna get sick like you could be at a fucking restaurant and your baby suddenly gets sick like bitch you need to know i just added a very thin comb just so i could always be able to brush it and comb her i also have these so yes bitch like i said i'm extra as fuck this one you um it's a little fan but you plug it up to like your iphone and it automatically starts fanning so i have it there just in case like i said um i need to use my phone to fan my baby you know for backup and then i have this one which it's like it no. does the job it just gives you a small little like like if you're blowing at your baby's face but like i said my baby cannot be suffering in this fucking texas um heat so this is a good little backup okay and lastly i added this so this was um part of the juicy couture um baggie or whatever it was like a little kind of keychain moment or whatever but i opened it and i put it on the other bag so here i just keep a little extra little pacifier like the small types um for baby girl in case she drops one of her pacifiers the bitch and you're like how am i gonna wash it i'm not like home or i'm not you know whatever you keep a backup one be smart bitch always have more than one and spread them out around everywhere like like i said i keep an extra pacifier in my mom's i have an extra pacifier in bed and yeah i have one extra one in her diaper bag okay so no matter what you never forget her pacifier because she's she's always going to have one in her diaper bag you know what i mean now in here i pretty much just keep extra little bowls that i know that um because she has big bowls but i'm not going to carry them for backup you know because yeah, yeah so i'm just keeping these little two little small little bowls just in just in case for some reason i'm really in that much of a hurry and i did not get a chance to put pick a bowl or a headband or whatever well i know that she has a white bowl and a pink bowl that could match potentially most of her outfits because you know i'm girly as fuck and i'm pretty sure like all my baby you know wears is like pink you know and then i keep this little extra clippies right here as well if you guys can see they're just you know oh i'm just dropping her shit oh my god but you know because they don't take up no space so why not you know i could just put it in her hair okay and lastly i just keep this no thing in the little baggie which is just little hair ties if you guys can see and then little like tiny tiny clip clippies like they're this one's pink just because of the fact that it doesn't take up any space but it's still like something for her hair so like i have little like ligas and and you like you guys saw i have a comb so you know in case i need to do her like little chonguitos or whatever or i have these little clippies that i could just put on her hair just because of the fact that you know it doesn't take up space so when you have a diaper bag you definitely me personally i want to fill it up with must-haves like my baby like i said i could i want to know that if i grab my my baby's diaper bag and i decide to spend the night at my mom's or anywhere that i'm fucking good that i'm not gonna be like oh damn but i have to go get this or i don't have this like you know or you never want to be out and about and then your baby's crying when you could have like solved the solution if you had just carried this one thing so i'm just the type like i said i just like to make sure so it all fits in the bag and that's what matters so that's why in this little bag i pretty much just like i said keep her extra little pacifier her little chupon and just any little tiny bowls that could fit in it 
just to have extra you know hair things because like i said sometimes you could be in a hurry and you literally have no time to do your baby girl's hair and it's like okay well at least i have a little ball and that's just the way i think like i said um i personally feel like i don't mind carrying everything that i carry just because you know most of the time we are out and about whether it's running an errand or going to the store or whatever the case is or you're just having fun and i know that in my heart i have everything that i need for my baby like i don't have to be like fuck like i don't have that you know what i mean so yeah this is pretty much what i carry for now that it's summer um i hope you guys enjoy this video and i hope if you mommies that are watching and whether you have a newborn or you've been having your baby you got some ideas maybe you got some ideas of what to carry right now in this heat because like i said you need to be thinking about your baby you know like little fans or i don't know like little things like that or just if you know like i said it'll make life easier like just know that there's little miniature sized things that you can squeeze in your bag and it won't make a difference but at the same time it'll make a difference when you're out and about or you know like you'll be able to pull out her little toys like a little bag like this just with a few little toys like it'll do the work so um so thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you mommies have any questions, like comment down below or just, yeah, just comment down below and let me know um, anything you guys want to see of me or if you have any questions of any of these items. I try to be very specific because, you know, I talk a lot. But um, yeah, stay tuned. I should be posting a baby must-haves baby must have video pretty soon either this week or next week when this is up um but it'll be pretty soon i'm already i've been planning on it forever but i just haven't done it but i'm yeah just stay tuned and also if you guys haven't already please subscribe give it a thumbs up and also follow my lash page because i'm working on things like i said that's why i haven't been consistent with the youtube but i'm trying but um my lash page on instagram is called at lash underscore dolls with two s's and yeah you guys can follow me there um to keep up you know when i'm gonna drop the lashes and you know just know that i'm gonna be showing a lot of love in that page like i'm gonna be liking pictures and just commenting and you know showing you guys love and you know i'll be giving back so just stay tuned for sneak peeks and etc but thank you guys for any support i appreciate it please subscribe and join my doll gang because we are about to get lit bitches we are about to get lit 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 and once i launch um my lashes we're gonna be hella lit so hashtag um doll gang and yeah subscribe bitches